and all new tonight here at 530 Charlotte Douglas International Airport preparing for a rush of holiday travelers amid the pandemic. Airport officials expect 17,000 local passengers next Tuesday, Wednesday and Saturday after Thanksgiving, with the Sunday after Thanksgiving being the busiest travel, busiest travel day with 22,000 local passengers. That's actually down from an average of 33,000 to 38,000 local passengers during the Thanksgiving travel period last year. WCNC Charlotte's Kendall Morris joins us live. Kendall, what do people need to know if they are flying this Thanksgiving? Well, Fred, if you haven't flown since March, there are a number of changes here at Charlotte Douglas International Airport that you'll notice as soon as you walk in the door. First, you got some plexiglass here when you check your bags. You got plexiglass here at the security lines, and you've also got reminders everywhere to wear a face covering. Charlotte Douglas bracing for the most travelers it's seen since mid-March. This is going to be a very busy place uh, over the Thanksgiving holiday. It already is a fairly busy place considering where we are uh, in relation to recovery from the pandemic. But it's not the same as last year. From the moment passengers arrive, they're required to wear face coverings. There's signage reminding people to keep their distance. There are 60 hand sanitizing stations throughout the airport and protective shields are up to keep customers and employees safe. The concourses will be busy at different times during the day, uh, and the hold rooms will be very busy, uh, where we have folks sitting and waiting for their aircraft. So we're trying to ask folks to be aware of that, first and foremost, and secondly, as best as we can, uh, everyone needs to do their part to socially distance uh, within the building as they're waiting to get on their flights. American Airlines gave WCNC Charlotte an inside look at their flight experience, starting with a new touchless system to check in bags. At the boarding area, customers are reminded to wear their face coverings prior to boarding and not huddle in groups. Between flights, crews of five to six people spend 15 to 20 minutes wiping down all high touch surfaces like seats, armrests and tray tables. An air filtration system recirculates air every two to four minutes and at least once a week, airplanes receive an electrostatic fogging that adds a layer of protection by getting into the creases of seats and hard to reach places. Airport officials showing the new way of flying in 2020, hoping to put passengers at ease this holiday season. OK, and this is actually a really cool new feature here at Charlotte Douglas this year. You can now see what the security checkpoint wait times are before you even arrive at the airport. This is all through the Charlotte Douglas International Airport app. So I can see that checkpoint D, which is behind me here, it's going to take 10 to 20 minutes to get through this line if you get to the airport right now. Live at uh, Charlotte Douglas International Airport, Kendall Morris, WCNC Charlotte. All right, taking a lot of measures. Kendall, thank you.